Love the attitude, and it's applicable to all sports, such as basketball, which started practice this week. Julia Lopez talked to the men's team and its new leader, first-year coach Justin Hudson. All right, thank you so much, Andrew. Yeah, Fresno State lost several key players. Seniors Jerron Hopkins, Jamel Taylor, Ray Bowles Jr., and Terrell Carter. Also, big man Bryson Williams, who started all 32 games for the Dogs last year. The Roosevelt alum is now at UTEP with Rodney Terry, but despite who the team is losing, the guys are focusing on who they're gaining. We're all pretty young, we're all pretty new to the Valley. Uh, only if uh, we don't have as, as many returners as we had in the past, but we have a great, a great young crew. Fresno State is coming off of a 21 win season, but this year's Bulldog team has a lot of new faces. Everybody knows about Nevada, everybody knows about New Mexico, San Diego State, but you, you can't write off the teams that's below. Like they rolled off of Colorado State a couple years ago, they picked like seventh, they ended up coming in second. So you never know, somebody can come from the bottom and rise up to the top. First year head coach Justin Hudson comes in and takes over a team after being an assistant at San Diego State and UNLV for the past 12 seasons. Taking over for Rodney Terry who left for UTEP and the players have already noticed a difference from last year. Coach Hutt doesn't want to uh, joystick our offense. He wants to kind of like let us play and experiment and uh, be free to uh, be athletic and be an experiment with our IQs and, and just be basketball players. He's trying to have a player team. He don't want us to play like robots. He's gonna, he wants us to go out there and play our game but don't get too crazy. I think we are a little different offensively right now than they're used to of trying to push the ball a little bit faster, trying to play more conceptually off the bounce. On Thursday, Fresno State held its first full practice under Coach Hudson and I had to ask. As a player, what do you prefer? Do you prefer a Terry practice or a Hudson practice? Um, uh, no comment on that one. <laughs> <laughs> All right, point taken. Senior forward Sam Bittner weighed in on the free flow of practice so far, and he says he enjoys it. I think uh, most players do. They want to be able to uh, be coached to and allowed to play. Um, but nothing's wrong with uh, the way Coach Terry uh, taught us, but just having a different style is just refreshing for lots of our players. And when it comes to the team goal, that remains the same. What I expect is to, uh, to win the Mountain West and to be a contender, not just have a build year because we have a new coach but to come in there and uh, really make some noise right off the bat. Fresno State is definitely a wild card in the Mountain West this year, but Coach Hudson and the dogs are ready to jump in. You know, I'm from the Valley, and I'm just happy to go out and meet all the great people and say hi and, and sell our vision for our program and university. You know, I'm hoping that they're excited. You know, it's time to get to work now for us and give them something to be excited about. Well, it looked like Coach Hudson was having a good time with that t-shirt cannon out there. You saw him out there. Yeah, I was right next to him. I was <laughs> trying not to get hit in the face with a t-shirt. So great aim, Coach. Appreciate yeah, that. No, definitely. And um, November 2nd is going to be the first time that we get to see the Bulldog men in action against Humboldt State in an exhibition game.